always aimed at the big kids, isn't it? On to the weather. Alexis is here. Still looking good for the rest of the week? We've got a lot of cloud in the forecast for the rest of the week. We do have some pictures, though. Ben Funk photographed the sunrise in Farnham. Craig Harvey took this shot of the morning frost in Chilbolton. So it was a very frosty start to the day. Temperatures in minus figures down to around minus four, minus five Celsius in some locations. Tomorrow we may have a little bit of a frost. Uh, this was the scene first thing this morning, the mist and the frost at Corfe Castle captured by one of our weather watchers. Now tomorrow we're expecting slightly more cloud. In the forecast yesterday, today wasn't meant to be as sunny as it was and that's because the cloud stayed up in Scotland and the north of the country. But we are expecting it to arrive during the course of the night. So more cloud overnight tonight and more cloud tomorrow. That cloud starts to sink its way southwards during the course of the night. Where we have the clearing skies initially, there is a chance we could have a little bit of a frost as well as some mist and fog patches. Temperatures tonight will fall away to around 1 or 2 degrees. These temperatures will be slightly higher during the second part of the night, maybe into minus figures for the first part of the night where we have clearing skies. So a lot of cloud in the forecast tomorrow. There will be some breaks here and there to allow for some sunshine. The temperatures will be up to around 8 or 9 degrees, slightly lower than today's Today we saw a high of 10 or 11, or maybe up to 10 in some parts, but generally a lot of cloud and temperatures will be suppressed. So on the inshore waters tomorrow, the winds are east or northeast, 5 or 6. The visibility is moderate or good, occasionally poor at first, and the sea state is slight or moderate. So there will be a lot of cloud tomorrow night and we're drawing air in from the northeast and that air is slightly less cold. So up to temperatures will drop away to around 5 or 6 Celsius, so slightly less cold tomorrow night. Looking ahead to Thursday, Thursday still a good deal of cloud, but we're hoping that the drier air coming off the near continent will make the cloud break in places to allow for some bright or sunny spells here and there. But generally, there will be a lot of cloud right the way through this week until the weekend. Still a lot of cloud over the weekend as well. So the cloud tomorrow could be thick enough uh, where we have the mist and fog over hilly areas to produce a little bit of drizzle in places. But generally, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, we will see some breaks in the cloud to allow for some sunshine. As the weekend arrives, we're looking at temperatures up to around 10 or 12 degrees. And into next week, well, things start to turn a little more unsettled. So a good deal of dry weather. But if you'd like to send us your weather pictures, you can do to southweather at bbc.co.uk. Thanks, Alexis. Uh, tomorrow, Berkshire knitters who will be making special blankets and pouches for the animals affected by the fires in Australia. More on that tomorrow. That's it from us this evening. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Good night.